Hello everyone and welcome to the Little Blue Fly. It's been a moment since I have been on here. Reason being my living room. Okay, the wallpaper up on the ceiling. Um, as we start decorating for fall, I will share um, a picture with you. It, it just became very frustrating. Not putting up the wallpaper, but the fact that I was absolutely so in love with this wallpaper. And when I put it up on my ceiling, no, it did not work at all all with the way I am going in the living room. Now, many of you know, I have shared photo after photo, video after video of this wallpaper with my decor. I just knew it was going to be perfect and it was not. It, if I can say this, it actually kind of looked a little bit um, underdone, okay, to keep it nice. Um, but anyhow, so I just shut down. I just went into my own little bubble and just said, okay, I'm going to be depressed for a little while, but I'm back with uh, so many wonderful fall videos to come. And well, that being said, let's begin, shall we? Okay, many of you know the drill here this is the side this is where I do my decor hauls and this is the last time you're going to see these two items on the wall we're going to move over the island and going to make some very simple inexpensive changes here in the dining area um, you know unfortunately don't have the finances to do all the custom work but I do when it comes to creativity. So I hope you're all ready for that. Okay, here we go. First link. Must go see these two ladies right here. Court of Two Sisters. Fabulous, fabulous decor. Cannot speak enough about them. Mention the little blue fly. Make sure to follow them on Instagram as well as me because I will be posting decorating sites. And just let them know the little blue fly sent you. Now this is the first piece I purchased from them. It is the true Himalayan rabbits vintage picture I have been trying to get my hands on. I did just recently decorate with a much smaller one in my hutch, which I love as well. Um, but I had that framed from Hobby Lobby. This is the true one right here. Now, because we are um, doing a collaboration, the ladies went ahead and gifted me this piece right here. Can we say gorgeous? Can we say, oh my gorgeous, on this frame? A stunner, for sure. Many of their items are stunning. They have a whole storage unit that is filled, ready to be sold. Um, Mother Daughter has been thrifting, I believe so, for many years, uh, doing these different types of auction sales. And they have so much beautiful decor just waiting to be sold. So the Himalayan rabbits, I did purchase that. They did cover shipping. The frame up at top was free, covered shipping. And then I have these two um, very heavy cast iron. I'm going to try to get them into... Um, a better view here not so blurry more into focus there we go perfect just aged goodness all over these cast iron pots and they did um gift these to me as well so again mention the little blue fly and make sure to follow them i will also link them in my description box below okay so we have something gifted right and something vintage now something new. Okay, for those of you 
that know me, you know I love when I see the BD circled Ballard designs. It's not that often I purchase from them, but when I do, I'm so excited. <laughs> this piece was on sale. Oh, the birdies over there, in case you are a window watcher. Um, they play in my umbrella. And the top piece of my umbrella, they like to go underneath the flap up there. It's the cutest thing ever. Okay, and here is my brass tiered tray. This will be in my kitchen. Now, they, again... I waited till this was on sale. With Ballard, I try my best to wait till everything is on sale that I purchase. This one is brass. They also have a silver. Very solid, very heavy. You can put a stack of plates. You could put bowls. Um, it can really take the weight because as you see, the glass is very thick. And that's what I was looking for. You know, not you know, a thin piece of glass. You have to be careful what you put on it. I really wanted to be able to display and present um, all of my different treasures. So I found it right here, the two-tiered tray. And again, it is by Ballard Designs. And here is just the back. I have something special. Many of you that have been following me know about Robin King. Robin King designs her, her artwork. Um, all of it is vintage inspired. And let me tell you, she really, really, really put something special out there for us all this fall. Make sure to mention the little blue fly. Type it in her coupon box to get a kind discount. Okay, are we ready? You know how I like to show the back. Here we go. We have the acrylic gold all around the edges. And look at this, a delicious French country weaved fruit basket. I love how she adds a different design in the backdrop. It just really gives her artwork so much dimension. I can never tire of the still lifes. Love them. It can go in any room, not just a kitchen. It can go in the living room. I can place it in my sunroom. And some people even like putting fruit in their bathrooms. Gorgeous, rich colors all throughout this plaque. It does come in two different sizes. Um, I'm not quite sure what the measurements are, but they are on her website. You can see the aged crackling all over the image. And again, put Beverly, not Beverly, <laughs> look, I'm so excited. I can't even talk right. Put the little blue fly in the coupon code for a kind discount. Now we have another plaque. This one, um, I hope you're ready. It is, if you love the blue and whites, this is a stunner, an absolute stunner. I'm telling you, Robin has some gorgeous new designs. I cannot say this enough. We'll start with the back and I'm going to lift up slowly. So this is just the top shelf. It is a hutch, right? We have the blue and whites. We have the red and whites, the gorgeous transfer wear. We have a landscaping picture on the second shelf with some nice canned goodness here, a little doily and a silver pot and a topiary. Is this not just stunning? Love, love. I'm loving her work right now. Look at this. Blue and white, red and white transfer wear. The little sheep. We have some ivy up here in a pot. Again, the aged crackle finish. Now, 
Now also in the Court of Two Sisters, make sure to mention the little blue fly that you came from me in her messages. And she will make sure to give you a kind discount as well. Here we have a chamber pot. So back in the old days, um, this they would use chamber pots um, in the evening time versus having to go out to the outhouse, right? But now, you know, we have become more modernized and we can make these chamber pots look absolutely gorgeous. And that is exactly what I plan on doing with this beauty. My husband just recently gifted this to me. He knows how I'm always looking for a new vessel to place something floral or whatever um, inside. And this was so just wonderful of him to purchase this for me. Beautiful detail. So we have all these rich, the golds and the bronze and the blacks and just all mixing together beautifully. Now this next piece is, I don't think I shared this with all of you yet, but you can see it has a little bit of chippiness. No worries. I know how to fix that with my glaze. Um, but this piece is very old world and I love the mixing the old world with the French country. Now sure, and the little key turn up at top, I could um, do a really nice plaster um, color on this as well. But you know, I think I want to keep these colors and just get a sweet little wicker shade for the top and just keep it old world. Maybe in time I might change it, but right now I'm really enjoying the colors. Amazing clearance sale here at Ballard Designs. These are Lucid taper candles. For those of you that don't know about Lucid, well, I'm about to tell you about Lucid. What is so fabulous about them is these tapers, they will never burn down, ever. They're $35 a piece. The black one, they mark down to $23.99. The tan one, or well, khaki, to $14.99. But it didn't stop there. They took off an additional 60%. Okay? So for two candles, I would have paid $70 plus taxes, right? Well, I got, I think there's 10 of them. I just paid $54. That's it. I... I went and took every taper candle they had. Well, no, I did leave a couple. Okay, so here's how they work. Down at the bottom, we have a gripper, which is great. So the taper candle doesn't try to tilt left, right. And up at top, you screw the top piece off. And it has this long... Um, it's, it's like a cotton like a cotton, um, I don't want to call it a wick. I know there's another name, but inside that is plastic. You fill it with oils and scents and the outside never burns. It is real wax. So you will always have this taper. It will never melt down. It just burns from the liquid inside. Total genius. So lucid candles. You might try to find some on the Ballard site. They might have some of these. I was in the store. And there they are inside the chamber pot. Okay, next. How oh, I just have to add in a little bit of whimsy. Love the pumpkin. All the colors again. Um, this is new from Robin. We have the pumpkin image on all sides and then on the inside again she always places her name and the year so it is a tissue box cover and but many of mine I don't use for tissues I will have flowers coming out of them or simply just use it as a riser as a stand for something Many of you are familiar with this one. Several of you purchased this um, in her plaque 
last year, and she decided to make a tissue box. Love the, the plaid on this piece. And again, we have all of the vintage crackling. Now I did state I wanted to receive several of these um, tissue boxes because I just want a very large collage of them because I cannot get enough of these gorgeous images like this one right here, her brown flowers. This has like, um, not so much a minty, well, maybe like a minty green. And then the, the hair just goes perfectly with the roses. And again, I'm going to eventually have a very large collage of these tissue boxes. That pumpkin is just super sweet and whimsy. And every one of them are in stock and ready for purchase for those of you that would love to add in some of Robin's artwork. And here we go again with the still life basket. How gorgeous. Now you can also get, uh, if you don't want the dark background, she also is offering it in like a, a beige background as well, which is just as beautiful. I just prefer the darker colors in my decorating. And I'm going to add in a touch of Christmas. Look at this Canadian goose. Super sweet. We have striping and just all sorts of different detail on this tissue box because Christmas is right around the corner. I mean, one could even have peppermint sticks coming out of this one if they wanted to. And there is a nice fall um, display of um, Robin's new artwork. And look how gorgeous blue and white goes with everything, with the rabbit picture, all the different tissue boxes. Blue and white, really, um, it's so classy and comfortable. You know, really, it, it's cozy. It, it doesn't give a, a fussy feel, right? Here's the backing to it. Um, I purchased six of them. Facebook Marketplace Find. And I'm going to go a different direction um, with my fall tablescape this year. I'm going to be playing with the blue and whites and just really bring in the vintage. So we'll see how it goes. So the turkey, plat uh, turkey plates... Um, they will be uh, on our table this year for Thanksgiving. Now, these are a pre-order. Okay, I need to stress, the, to stress that. These will not be in for three weeks. But right now, Robin is taking orders on these next two pillowcases I'm sharing. This is the artichoke with the black hound's tooth. She also has it where the hound's tooth is a beige color. For those of you that don't play with the dark um, colors as much. And again, that is her artichoke. They are 18 by 18. And I'm trying to get the next one. Again, the hound's tooth. Such class, right? With a gorgeous sunflower. It has the zipper down at the bottom. And she also has other images as well. When you visit her website, you will see them. 
I'm loving all these colors, just loving them. These apples, um, I purchased these from Target, just $3, that's it for the bag. Just little sugar apples. And if I can find everything else I'm trying to gather together, I will be making something. If not, I'll just place them inside um, some vessels. But they're sugared apples. They have the red and you can see some of the yellow and the orange coming through. I just really like these for just $3. Doesn't get any better than that. Okay, when I was in Williams, Sonoma, because I went in there to look at, you know, different types of linens and dishware, but I came across this artichoke and garlic pizza sauce. Look at this. A savory blend of artichoke hearts, garlic, citrus, and spices. This jar makes three 12-inch pizzas. And to go with the pizza sauce, I have a pizza cutter from William Sonoma. For, and for those of you that are in, might be interested in watching me make a pizza, let me know because I'll do a video of um, making like three different types of pizza. Why not? <laughs> we are going into the baking season. Okay, Pottery Barn, I'm trying to zoom in here. Harvest Spice. Now we're gonna start bringing in the fall. Delicious scent. For those of you that have a pottery barn, go into it. It was $29.50, right now $7.97. But in two weeks, two to three weeks, they told me it's going back up to the $29 price. So go in there and see if they have it was up um, at the front cash registers with the um with the candles. Speaking of, I did purchase a candle. And this is when I wish we had smell -a vision because I'm telling you, I would not lie to any of you. This Harvest Spice scent is incredible. It's not overbearing with the cinnamon. It, it, it's just the perfect amount of um, scents in here. It's very romantic, very calm, and the color is perfect. So this is what I will be burning this fall. And I was able to find some linens at Pottery Barn. Normally I find them at Williams Sonoma, but because I'm going more vintage tones this year, Pottery Barn is what had. Um, my items. These were $29.50. Very nice, thick linen. They're not made of linen. It's just, it's, well, I mean, 100% linen, but they are um, very nice to work with. And these, for some reason, the camera, well, to me anyways, it's looking kind of grayish. Those are not. They are blue and very much so match the plates. But the lighting is different right now in this room. It doesn't know whether it wants to be sunny or if it wants to rain here in Northern Virginia. And now for... I believe this is the last piece. It is a wicker pumpkin from Pottery Barn, marked down to, what is that, $22.97, it was $79. But again, in just a couple weeks, it's going back up. So get into Pottery Barn, go um, to Instagram for Quarter Two Sisters, and make sure to subscribe. And if you haven't subscribed to my Instagram, make sure you do that as well, as, as well as visiting Robin King. I hope you all enjoyed the video and I will be back this week with decorating.